Get in the top, please get in the top. Thanks. Get my top. You're not. Whoa! <laughs> okay. we've, wow. been a, we've been in a tub together. Look at this. <laughs> please get out of my tub. <laughs> oh. oh, I can't get out. Tomorrow is a big day. Cole and Abby, we're going to try and help them out. Yeah. We've got some catfishes to find. We do, we do, we do, we do. Get some sleeps. Don't I be late do. tomorrow. Good night, Oobs. Oh, Let's go. Is your seatbelt on, sir? It is on. <laughs> so, halfway from Glasgow to Dumfries and to the lovely barbershop of Abby and Cole. You do need a trim. I do need a trim. Let's do it. If I'm the driver, you should have the brolly. Oh, and now right. you want to run because your hair's yeah, getting wet. Yeah. Let's go. I think this is it, right? Hey! Hello. Nice to meet you. Thank How's you it going? So much. <laughs> nice to meet you. Uber. Yeah, I'm Paul. Nice, nice to meet you. To meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> it's so lovely sorry. to see you both. Yeah, I hope that we can so build up enough of a rapport so by the end I can cheekily ask for a haircut. So that's <laughs> what I'm <doing>. awesome. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this has been a mad year for you guys. Crazy. Yeah. One of the craziest years of, yeah, ever. <laughs> can you kind of walk us back and tell us a story? Yeah, go back to that first video. It's kind of um, boredom. Set yeah. in, and we're like, what can we do for a bit of fun? And then within a few weeks, it just went, phew, our account went crazy. Yeah. We had a few hundred thousand followers. We would go to bed at night and we'd think, this is amazing. Like, everybody like, would dream of this. How did we get this? This is amazing. So you've got hundreds of thousands of followers. Mm -hmm. Then what happens next? Fan accounts. Yeah. Which is great, but you also get the flip side of the fan pages and they're not all nice. The more followers we got, the more hate you get. The more hate you got. Okay. And it really, really affected me as a person. Mm. And I don't want to do that to my wife and kids. Mm -hmm. So that's why we're trying to find, hopefully, a way to resolve this so we can continue. Or stop. Whatever or stop. one is best for us and our family, that's what's going to happen. Yeah. So from an outside perspective, something like getting gifts it's generally like a good thing to have. Like it's might be a like quite a nice thing to wake up to. It like started happen. off really nice. And right. It did give me that feeling to start with. And told this fan page, everything feels really sinister. Mm. Right. Like everything about it. We've got a couple of screenshots of the Cole and Abbey fun fan yeah. page, so I could show you them. That would be yeah. really helpful. Yeah, oh, yeah, that would be amazing. And that's their page there. And what's scary about this page is, this is not a profile photo that we have ever shared on social media. Online. So I've got no idea yeah. how, how this photo is on social media. And that's what makes me think, is it somebody that we know? This was us on live last night. And if you look here, Cole Abbey fan page, I will always win. Jesus. That said every live. Every live. Yeah, they're, they're sending us a present and then saying, I will always win, I told you. I can show nice. you. I can show you the gifts. Yeah, they come in really. Well, we would like to see them. Yeah. 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 And so it started out just as a normal fan page. Yeah, it started off as a normal regular fan things yeah. on social media. Yeah. And then a physical gift comes to the shop first. It started off at the shop. Okay. This is where I get worried because it's now came to my house. So there, we've got no privacy. Right. Oh my god. This is so personal. That's our wedding song, came and they've always got a note saying, I will always win. Wow. Reading that literally win? makes my skin crawl. I mean, this all sounds so scary. They know where we stay, but how do they know? Do they know us? Yeah. They are literally leaving no trail. No, they don't want to They've be They've not tripped up once. They do not want to be found. I think at this point, for us, mm. the number one is your marriage. You feel like it's the first thing in your relationship that's drove a wedge between oh, you. Ever. Yeah. yeah, we're known about being that happy, yeah. positive couple yeah. all the time. But this is destroying me. It's changing our personality, and I'm watching every day a little bit of my wife fade away. I'm really sorry. I'm not here. What are you doing? Outside, please. What's please. this, man? Huh? Don't do this to me here. What? You're humiliating me in front of everybody. Me? 